gray seems to be the popular color. Yet it has to start from a source of white corrupting itself slowly into the black. If only life was white or black, unfortunately isn't. And the many shades of grey is what the film or serial aria is about. Directed by Ram Madhavan, Sandeep Modi and Vinod Rawat, this Sushmita Sen showcase is a seven and a half tribu hour tribute to the brilliance, the style quotient, the elegance, the diction, and that balanced act that Sushmita Sen brings on to television. At a time when people are talking and talking loudly about camps, groups, interests, it is indeed intriguing that an actress of such great talent, Miss Universe, Sushmita Sen, somehow did not get that kind of space that her contemporary Miss World got. Many, many people I have met have believed that Miss Sen is a much more gorgeous looking person and somebody they would like to see more often on screen than the Miss World that they have seen. Without going into that controversy and restricting myself to analyzing Arya, full marks go to Sushmita Sen for carrying the seven and a half hour serial spent over nine spells of 50 minutes each with her sheer persona as an actress, as a mother, she has perfected the role. Probably she is revisiting what she did in Samay and it's not the first time that the role of the mother is played. We've seen Aishwarya Rai Bachchan play it in Jasba. We've seen Sri Devi do it in Mom. I think Sushmita Sen is miles ahead of both those interpretations of a hurt mother. Her performance is far more compelling to watch, far more intriguing, and in style, awesome. Storyline. She is married to Tej Chandrachud Singh. They have three children, Veer Adi and Arundhati. Veer is played by Viren Vazirani, Arundhati by Vriti Vagnani, and little Adi by Pratyaksh Pamar. Her father, Zoravar Jayan Kriplani, heads a pharmaceutical company who is married to Sonalia Kapoor, who is a nagging old cigarette smoking wife and has a live-in relationship with a girl called Radhika, played by Flora Saini. His man Friday, to do all his jobs, dirty and clean, is Daulat, played by Sikandar Kher. Tej's business partners are his brother-in-law, played by, as Sangram, played by Ankur Bhatia, and Namit Das playing Jawahar. The three partners don't really agree with how the pharmaceutical business should go on. While Sangram and Daulat believe that there must be an exponential growth of the black part of the pharmaceutical industry, namely drugs and substance, Tej would like to keep it down and not go there. What happens? Very early, even as uh, even as Arya's sister is getting married, in the midst of all this, there is a small fight at the party with Jawhar threatening Tej. But the next morning, Tej is shot dead. Jawhar, apart from being ambitious and wanting to make quick money is also a drug addict. 
is he the killer or is Manish Chaudhary Shikhavat the don who makes all the money who's into big time drug peddling with foreigners is he the man who's avenging this family because a large consignment of his drugs went missing I'm not going to play spoil sport and answer the question for you but what happens interestingly and what is the story about is how Arya a nice romantic happy housewife suddenly is compelled by circumstances to come to terms with not only the death of her husband who shot dead but a police officer ACP Khan played by Vikas Kumar who's stroking her to find out the truth her three children two of them who are going through problems of adolescence in the midst of the death of their father and little adi deep psychological impact on him as he is the sole eye witness to the death of his father there is in the midst of all this zora wars man friday daulat played by sikandar khair who's always available for arya to help her out of problems how much how far and what happens in this dark world of drug peddling sorrow adultery killings murder mayhem and all that surpassing all this is the brilliance of sushmita sen i would believe that sitting for seven and a half hours and watching something as taut and morbid as this would tell on your nerves so my advice watch it in parts and you will really savor the experience everyone i'll name a few of them vritti vagnani as arundhati viren vasrani as veer as the two children in their adolescence very good performances then there is sonali kapoor playing the old wife of zorabar disappointed of the relationship that zorabar has with radhika amazing socialite performance ankur bhatia as the brother of arya who's in jail caught for drug peddling is amazing in that claustrophobic jail he comes out with a fine performance then there is namit das a revolution in the negative role as a villain in the piece maya sara remember you saw her in tappad the other day her hairstyle remains the same but her performance is again very compelling and worth watching manish chaudhry playing shikawat the drug peddler cool cool cat performance from him vikas kumar as the acp every move of his may go wrong but no move of his as an actor goes wrong two performances that really stand out are sikandar khair as daulat and of course to return to the main topic the role that Sushmita Sen plays once for a lifetime. I really wish that this act, this style icon, has who has so much to offer, is seen by filmmakers, big film houses, and given her due. Otherwise, the loss is entirely ours. Arya, seven and a half hours worth watching. You don't get. too many serials to see like this her performance is far superior to the mothers avenging their daughters kidnap or rape as we have seen in that i have named before there is also this sham benigal skaliyug hangover that you can discern in the film over there if the inheritor of the mess is victor banerji over here it's the other bengali lady sushmita sen and a near perfect performance i would also say about the penultimate episode is when you come to know who the possible killer could be but don't miss seeing it till the last 
there are still some interesting twists and turns that await you. I believe that this serial would almost give one of our all time great television artists, Shefali Chaya, the run for her money for her performance in Delhi Crimes. Don't miss this serial, don't miss Arya, if for nothing, to understand how emphatically Sushmita Sen converts her role from a romantic, nice, fashionable lady to an unwilling Don, but who can be cool and calculated. Watch, unhesitatingly watch Arya. Thank you.